Hey, let me just see you. Do that seat. Come in on the seat, too. Have a seat, you. Have a seat. Lovely to see you. How are you, sir? I'm all right. Good. Good. You're very welcome. Do you know all these people, or is this a new? Is this a meeting? This is a meeting. Oh, lovely. Who is this? <laughs> <laughs> I want you to know that I can't not see you on the toilet. Now. <laughs> I like the cut of your jib. <laughs> Thank you, Johnny. Right now. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I'm just glad Johnny wasn't out for the awkward <laughs> customs chat at the beginning. Oh, yes. <laughs> awkward customs? <laughs> Our customs story. Yeah, right. No, no, listen. I, my, my gerbils are clean. <laughs> uh, now, there's been stuff in the papers. I don't know if it's true. Are you moving here, Johnny? Is this the move to Manchester? Yes. It's possible, I guess. <laughs> okay. I mean, have you gone to see a house in Manchester? No, I haven't. <laughs> no, I've actually never been to Manchester. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've always wanted to go, but... Yeah, no, I've never been. Okay, so... so but I'll take a house there, I mean, why you not? You do it! Yeah. You do, yes. Apparently, I already live in Bath as well. Oh, really? Yeah, I was seen buying spatulas and stuff. <laughs> Good, that's a very good celebrity sighting. Johnny Depp buying a spatula in bar. Yeah. It might be my favourite of my own. Yeah. <laughs> uh, now, you're in town because uh, the new movie, Alice Through the Looking Glass, it's yeah. coming out on the 27th of May. I knew the first movie was a success. I didn't realise how big it took over a billion dollars. It's one of the most successful films of all time. Is that right? Yeah. What? Which one? Alice, a Alice, more than an uh, X-Men? Uh, more than anything. More than bad um, education? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Alice through the looking glass. Uh, you return as the Mad Hatter, and in this one, Alice is traveling through time. Yes. Okay. Um, and, <laughs> uh, and everyone's back. Matt Lucas is back. Helen Bonham Carter. But Sasha Baron Cohen is in this one. No, he's not back. No, he's not back, but he's in it. He's, he's in it. Who, who... Oh, yeah, of course he's in it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, so, yeah, Sasha's, uh, he plays time. He plays Father Time, basically. And, um,. It was, we, we, we've known each other for a good long while and I've always admired him, you know, um, back since Ali G. And so, <laughs> why is that funny? <laughs> yeah. uh, we've got a clip. This is you as the young Mad Hatter uh, meeting, because of the traveling through time business, you're meeting okay. Alice for the first time. Okay, good. Okay. Hatter? Hatter? You again. Well, if I'm not, I wish I was. <laughs> Have we met? Yes. Well, no, I mean, not yet. It's funny, I feel I shouldn't know you. Well, we have met once, when I was younger. Oh, well, I'm afraid I don't recall. That's because it hasn't happened yet. Oh, when will it happen? Years from now, when you're older. I'll meet you when you're younger and I'm older. I realize it doesn't make much sense. Makes perfect sense to me. I'm Karen. I know, I'm Alice. Alice, you seem to have time all mixed up. Now, we know that you, you do this thing as an actor, you love transforming, you like kind of being consumed by characters. Like but me. The, yeah, very that, like you. Yeah. As a, as it's a, the English stand-up comedian. Yeah. <laughs> we're going to hide together <laughs> but in costumes. Your latest one is phenomenal. Uh, this, this is a picture of Johnny Depp as Donald Trump. Oh. What? Oh. Oh. Isn't that amazing? Wow. What was that for, John? Oh, my God. That was just for me. He was my <laughs> <laughs> You wanted to know what it felt like to be that awesome? Yeah. That was a weekend. Be that, I never uh, thought I to wanted to kill Johnny Depp before. <laughs> <laughs> um, I can only it... say that you should. <laughs> <laughs> how did it come up? Did, did you already do a Donald Trump impression? No, 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 no. And I had no idea if I could or not. And I still don't. But I, I mean, this, you know, Adam McKay, who I, uh, I admire greatly and who's one of the funniest humans alive, we had a meeting and we were sitting there talking and he said, how would you like to, <laughs> how would you like to do a feature film in four days? And I went, I like that idea. <laughs> and then he said, how would you like to play Donald Trump? 
and I loved that idea. <laughs> I didn't care if I knew if I was capable or not, you know. I wanted to try, so, yeah, so I, 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 <laughs> I did my bit as Donald Trump. You don't want to be Donald Trump. Right? <laughs> because he's, the way he speaks is very specific. Yeah. Were you telling all the Mexicans to get offset? <laughs> I told them to build me that wall. I want a sensational wall. <laughs> I want a fabulous wall. <laughs> I don't remember what the question was, but it doesn't matter because I'm not going to answer it anyway. <laughs> wow. Very good. Wow. It's amazing. Wow. Have, you, have you met the Trump at all at things, Jennifer? I haven't, no, I was at um, a Donald. concert that I heard he was attending, so I had my full security, like, I was like, find Donald Trump, because I was just, I was adamant on um, finding him and then making a video of me going, hey, Trump, fuck you. I wouldn't rest, I wouldn't rest until I found him, and I think he... He knew I was looking for him. Uh, now, one of the things about sort of being Johnny Depp is people must, you know, want to come up and say hi, they want selfies and things. And I just want do you have any sort of sympathy for those people? Because how young were you when you met Iggy Pop? Your band was supporting him? Is that what, how it happened? Yeah. I was um, 17 years old. We were on tour. We we'd sort of did a lot of opening act stuff, you know, around. And, uh, we were we had two shows with Iggy Pop in Gainesville. So yeah. I mean Iggy was one of my heroes, you know. And uh, so I'm 17 years old. We do the gigs with Iggy. It's the second night. I know he's splitting. I'll never see him again. I want to meet him, but I don't want to go. I need a big hand in your music. <laughs> and I don't know. It's just you know I, I needed something different. So I got in uh, you know in incoherent. Me drunk. <laughs> Pints of like vodka, just to work up the nerve to say something idiotic, which you shouldn't have to do. So, yeah, uh, he was walking around with a beagle. I don't know why. <laughs> After the show, you know, lights are on. He doesn't know why either. <laughs> so I thought, I'll get him. And I, and I just started screaming, Iggy Flop. <laughs> Piggy slop! <laughs> and a few other God knows what, you know, I'm not sure what more rhymes with that. So <laughs> he walked over to me <laughs> with this beagle on a leash and he got like that close to my face. And I'm looking at Iggy Pop's blue eyes. <laughs> and it takes so much time and he just says, you little turd. <laughs> to this day, to this day, it's one of the best moments in my life. Uh, we must also say, uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, you, went, you finished Pirates of the Caribbean, it's on the way now? Uh, well, yeah, I mean, it, it doesn't come out until, like, May of 2017 or oh. something. Do you know who's going to be really excited to see that? Good God, who? Young Captain Jack at the end there. Why? Yeah. Oh, for God's sake! Why is she doing the Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Did you own any regular clothes oh, no. as a child? That's my granny Look and granddad as well. That's I made funny. my granny and granddad come as sailors, and my granddad looks like he's in a Jean Paul Gaultier advert. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's time for music. This